Power on the main disconnect switch to energize the 48 volt DC power supply which powers the Liebshine MX3660 motion controller. The controller's green LEDs will illuminate and the red LEDs will flash. Pressing the start button latches a C1 contactor. One of the four pairs of the C1 contacts enables the MX3660 via wires 300 and 304. Contactor C1 also powers the brushless DC drive, which we'll refer to as BLDC. When powered, the BLDC displays H0. 5 volts DC on wire 301 originates on the BLDC and is sent to the MX3660 controller to power the spindle speed circuit of wire 302. Wire 300 is a common reference for all of these signals. Once the Z, X, and Y axes are referenced, a spindle command enables the BLDC by grounding wire 306. Schematically, I illustrate this as a contact closure. Wire 302 provides a voltage between 0 and 4 volts, representing the spindle speed between 300 and 10,000 RPM. Troubleshooting the BLDC A broken connection of wire 306 will prevent the BLDC from enabling. A loose connection of wire 306 can cause erratic spindle speed, especially under load. Now we can isolate these conditions by jumpering wire 300 and wire 306. A broken connection of wire 302 can cause the spindle to turn slowly regardless of the spindle speed set in path pilot. A loose connection of wire 302 may also cause erratic spindle speed under load. We can isolate these conditions by jumpering wire 301 and 302 for a short period so as not to overspeed the spindle.